the memo system displays the results of all contracts you bid on. Congratulations, you won a contract. If you have enough units in production, the game will ship the minimum contracted order amount before shipping units to other manufacturers and consumers. If you don't have enough units in production, the office will greet you with this pop-up window. Clicking the button will open up the Assign Contracts panel of the Mega Menu. This will show you all your current contracts. You are not producing enough units for any red listed contract. You're producing enough units for any green listed contracts. Selecting a contract will display the contract requirements here. This is the number of units you need to produce each month. This is the total number of units remaining for the contract. Here is the amount you're producing and how many are in inventory. For vehicles, you produce them as normal. In this panel, you can select which factory location the contract sources vehicles from. To do so, select the contract from the list, select the factory from this drop-down, and then click Apply. Now any vehicles needed for this contract will come from this factory first. For components, things are a little different. This section now displays a factory assignment panel. The panel displays the number of units in production, the total needed for all contracts, and the total needed for all contracts per month. This area displays what factories are producing the component. This button allows you to assign the production of a component to a factory. The window lists every contract using the component for the contract you initially selected. Any red contract is unfilled, and green contracts have the minimum amounts produced each week. Below is a list of factories with open production lines. On the right is information about the selected factory and the sum of all contracts that require the component. To assign a factory, click the Assign to Factory button. This button will add a production line to produce this component at the selected factory. Once all contacts are green, you can close the window. To remove a production line assignment from a factory, click the production line on this list. Then click the Remove Contracted Component from Factory button. You can also remove a component from production via the factory production system. If you want to fill contracts faster than the minimum orders, you must enable the Ship All Required Vehicles Contracted checkbox in the Mega Menu Auto Commands. This setting will ship any excess inventories to contract customers after consumers receive their orders. If you wish to cut back on production management, you can enable Auto Produce in the Auto Commands. Enabling this system will give control of production to the AI. Contracts often require operations in a specific city or country. When countries switch to full war status, the game terminates all civilian contracts from within those countries without a breach. The game will generate more contracts for these countries, but it limits bidding to companies whose HQ are in that country. The full war status halts production in the affected cities. If you have a military contract with your HQ country, you can produce the unit for that contract at any factory in your HQ country or any factory not at war.